Alright guys, today I'm going to show you how to make money as a teenager. Before you click off of this video because I'm a kid, don't. Because you're the one who's looking up how to make money as a kid. So take this advice from me because I am a kid. I have personal experience and you can take some of my advice. Anyway, I've used a couple of these strategies myself and they really do work. You gotta believe me here. So make sure you stick around to the end of the video for the best shot of making money as a teenager. Okay, so the first tip to making money is, you've probably heard of this before, it's called Fiverr. Fiverr is kind of like a website where you can sell things, but it's not really things. It's kind of like personalized videos, templates, uh, whatever. So um, it, some examples of things on Fiverr is like, say you want to do a gaming stream and you want to have, you, you know how sometimes they had those um, overlays, which is kind of like those, I don't know how to put it in a better words, it's kind of like an overlay of the stream where it has like your name, a couple designs, your uh, other social medias, but you don't know how to make it. So you would go on the Fiverr and you'd be like, you would type in chat, I need an overlay. I mean, not the chat, the search bar, my bad. And then something would come up with people trying to sell, they can make overlays for you and then sell it to you online. Most of the things on Fiverr are online. So if you're gonna sell stuff on Fiverr, if you have like a special talent of making things, making edits, making whatever, go on Fiverr and try to sell it. You can make really good money and then you also can make uh, like a bronze package, which is like the worst one, uh, silver, which is like the medium, and gold, and then platinum, which I think you get the point. But like, what I mean by that is like, gold, say you're making an overlay, gold would have like all these special like icons and cool fonts and colors, and then while well, the bronze would have like, you know, just the basic uh, t channel name and like maybe a few designs. But uh, anyway, moving on to the next tip to making money. So tip number two is gonna be making a YouTube channel. And obviously it's every kid's dream to, you know, get a million subscribers on YouTube, be famous and all that. But in order to make good money on YouTube, you don't necessarily have to have a million subscribers. Take me for an example. At the time of me recording this, I only have 2,000 subscribers. And I've already um, made really good money and I've only been monetized for a little bit. I don't, I don't feel comfortable sharing my actual revenue, but um, yeah, YouTube is, um, it's a great way to make money. Uh, obviously, different topics get different amounts of money. Like, the least amount of money is like these short videos of just like I used to make these shark puppet videos. They don't make any video, uh, any money. Some of these meme vi meme videos, like the Rick Astley memes, they don't make any money. But if you're making videos about money, they make a lot of money and like finance, anything like that, they make big money. Even if you get like 100 views, you can still get like 60 bucks off of that, and that's like crazy. Because if you end up getting like 10K subs and you get like 200 bucks on each video, 200 views, my bad, you could get like $120 on each video, which is absolutely insane. So with that being said, let's move on to tip number three, which is gonna be renting. And renting could be literally anything. You could even rent online stuff, but most of the time it's gonna be stuff in person. Say you have old stuff that you don't use anymore and someone needs it, you could just rent it out if, and if you don't if you don't want to necessarily give it away forever, you can just rent it out with it, which is a really easy way to make uh, money because you're not getting rid of anything and you're making someone else happy and you're getting good money. Nah, it's not like a huge amount of money for each rent, but it's still a really good amount of money similar to um, just selling stuff. It's better than that because you get it back afterwards, so. That's a really good thing to do. And when I say that you can rent out online stuff, I'm talking about like, well, not really online, but like you can rent out a computer if someone needs like a project or something. It's not really online, but you know what I mean. Moving on, tip number four. Tip number four is eBay, which is really similar to renting, except you usually don't get it back most of the time. And we all know what eBay is, so I really don't have to get into it. I don't want to waste your time. So let's move on to number five. And we've all heard of number five, which is gonna be online surveys. You know, in games, you know, you can always get like, what, whatever, free gems if you take these surveys. And they really don't give you a lot of money. But hey, if you're looking for some, a little extra cash on the side, it's a good idea. It doesn't really take that long. And some, some surveys give more, some surveys give less. And if you want some free gems, you can use it. So this next one I'm about to tell you, which is number six, I believe, is called Voices. And you probably have no idea what I'm talking about. And it was really, really interesting to me because I actually was looking up how to get some money. And this one came up and I was like, wow, that seems really, really cool. So Voices is like, it's a website and you can go on and it's for people who need voices for their videos. And you can do a voiceover for any character from like an animated TV show to a talk show. Not a talk show, I'm, I don't even know what I'm saying. 
But like you know, you know what the infographic show, they have the voiceover guy. You can be like that guy for a different channel. So it's really cool and they take uh ages of they take people of all ages. I'm like messed up here. But um I looked up they have a whole bunch of teen jobs, little kid jobs, adult jobs, old guy jobs, a whole bunch of everything. And it's really, really cool to me. And because you can like make really good money off of this if you get a, a full-time job like the people hiring you actually like you you can get some really good money so with um yeah let's go on to the next one so this one to me is actually really cool too and i actually thought about doing it but i don't have enough skill to do it um i mean i do but i'm just too lazy so this one is called reselling items which means that you're gonna buy crappy used stuff on ebay or whatever then um fix it up and make it look really nice and then sell it for a lot more and this can end up getting you a lot of money depending on what it is. You've probably seen those videos of the guy who like found the uh, Jordans dug up in the mud. You're probably not going to do stuff like that. But um, that's the concept of it. So you're going to get old stuff. You're going to fix it up, make it look nice. And then sell it for a lot more money. And this has got people rich. I'm not saying it's going to get you rich. But if you want to give it a shot, go ahead. Next one. So this next one is going to be the last one, but it's probably the most efficient. Um, I don't know how old you guys are watching this, but if you're like over 16, you can get a part-time small job working at like whatever. Uh, as long as you don't need to go to college for it, you can get, uh, you know, at least I think they're raising the minimum wage to $15 an hour, which is pretty good um, for not, you know, doing a whole bunch of work. It's sometimes it can be fun, whatever you're doing, working at a store that you like, but um yeah, I don't know how old you guys are, and that one really only applies to the older kids watching this. Um, and yeah, if you thought any of these um, ideas were helpful, please subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. I plan on uploading more videos like this if this does good, which probably it won't because all my videos suck. But let's say this gets some views. I'll do another one with more tips and help you guys out even more. So yeah, that's going to be the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, yeah, like I said... Please, if you don't sub, uh, subscribe, I, I'm, it's fine to say it's your choice. I'm just saying it is free. And if you like this video, just, just please. I really appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.